Hey, this is Michael, Max. Uh, I am back now in my hometown in Spokane and uh, just watching these two groups of geese that sort of refuse to integrate. You can see sort of in the lower part of the screen there are four. Maybe I could zoom this a little bit. There's seven geese this is on the Spokane River, just literally right behind my house. Um, there's seven geese, and then there's these four. And the two groups will drift into each other's, you know, near orbit. And then one from each group typically will go out and shoo the others away. So they seem to be not willing to integrate the seven and four to make an 11. But uh, anyway, I just wanted to do a final video. Um, you can see the Spokane River is extremely low. The snowpack was low this year, and as a result, the river has, this is a this river is very very high in the spring when the snow melts. But in any case, I hadn't really done a final video, and it's been a week now. Literally, I finished a week ago and flew back home the next day. Um, I am so glad that I did that hike. I'm really glad that others uh, enjoyed uh, the blog and the videos. Um, it taught me a lot about myself, and uh, I'm going to go back to the geese and see how they're doing. And uh, I just, uh, it was definitely different than a typical through hike, but especially with Hammer there in the last week, um, it made it feel very much like a through hike at the end. But the lack of other hikers around to consult with or commiserate with was just a real interesting dynamic. Um, I'm not, I'm not ruling out doing another one like that in the future. Um, there were dangerous moments. I feel like I was far more at risk walking the highways uh, than I've ever been in any trail, uh, including even the times when I had really perilous uh, falls and so forth. But anyway, I just wanted to say a thank you to anybody who managed to watch some or all of the videos if so if you're watching this one right now thank you for uh you know taking the time to follow along and i hope it was uh mildly interesting slash entertaining and if not no big harm um you know as you can see i'm not professional at this at all i i don't really put much effort into it other than wanting to capture memories as a trigger for you know so i can go back later and and think fondly of all the time that I had. So that's my primary reason for doing it, that and letting family and friends know where I am and so forth. But uh, no aspirations to become a hiking personality. I just like being me. And uh, with that, I'll leave you with the geese on the Spokane River. Thanks again.